So one of the magical things about um, being in business is you can hire a COO, you can have marketing directors, you can have everything in the world, and yet you still feel like your calendar is absolutely busting at the seams. And so one of the keys that I've learned over the last year is number one, to charge your mouse, because my mouse isn't charged. But number two, um, oh no, my keyboard's not charged um, right here. Uh, uh, one of the keys I've learned is that whenever you get um, leverage, which is obviously what I consider myself, leverage king, leverage master, whatever you want to call it, um, you can't always just replace it with more uh, stuff. You can, but if you just leverage and replace it with more stuff, you actually really never get leveraged. And so obviously as you grow, you have to add more stuff to your plate, but you wanna maybe, if you remove it 100%, you maybe wanna add 80% more, right? That 80% more is better, bigger activities, better money making, higher dollar productive activities, whatever you wanna call it. However, you can't just go and add everything, right? So. That's one thing I'm really bad at. Um, I'm currently in a cycle in my life where I have eliminated all the small tasks, um, yet I still find myself doing pretty much everything else that is big and important. So, yeah. So right now I'm just uh, trying to clear my calendar for the week so I can make some time for some things. Actually feels good to be back in the office, Dan. <laughs> First time ever. It feels good to have a working computer. It does feel good to have a working computer, too. All it takes is a little smack. That's all electronics work. All it takes. How do I... All right, so I'm going to give you guys a little tip and trick. Um, we're just gonna be shooting a lot of video here just to kind of see if I come across any tips and tricks in the middle of the day. One of my favorite tips and tricks, I get you and Android users out there, but it's so stupid, right? Like Android, I think is great, I get it. It's like if you're techie and do coding and all this stuff. But one of the best things I love about my Apple product is I can be on my computer, I can be on my iPad, and I can be on my MacBook, and I can open up the same 10 windows. <laughs> So one of the things I read last year was a book called The One Thing. I've read it like every year for 10 years. And so like, I know what my one thing is. My one thing is scheduling events. I need more events, more stages. That's all I should be doing. So when I log into my computer, my computer tabs are ordered in the things I should be doing. So tab one is like, uh, Facebook, right? Why, why is Facebook? Well, that's where I get a lot of my events from. I'm messaging people, interacting with people. The next tab is my top 100. These are the top 100 people that I'm getting events from, so I need to be reaching out to them. When's the last time I talked to them? Um, and then the third is my events calendar. Like, what's what's open for the next 12 you know, weeks? And what are we having to pay for? Where, what am I getting paid for, right? What are all these things? And then the last one, is just a whole bunch of group chats with the team, right? Marketing materials, all of those things. So why I like Apple. What's the fifth one? I don't know, I forgot already. The reason I like Apple though, the reason I like Apple is I can be on my computer, on the plane, with a hundred tabs open, they're all really important the way my brain works. And I come onto this computer and I can click a button and add all those same tabs from that other computer directly to this computer. So it opens it up as if I'm still on my other computer. Same with my iPad. Just works really, really well, saves a lot of time, um, and don't have to go reopen a whole bunch of windows. One hour later. One eternity later. Uh, oh.